my sister just called me dude. <laughs> That's, uh, that comes with living in California. Dude is a gender-neutral term here. Everything is dude. Guys are dude. Girls are dude. Pets are dude. Inanimate objects are dude. It's like... I open the freezer and, like, a bag of peas falls out and I catch it because video game reflexes and I'm just like, DUDE! Get the hell back in there! <laughs> like, that's... That's one stereotype of California that I can say absolutely holds up is everybody says dude all the time. <laughs> oh, there it is. That's the gymnasium. Okay. Well, I'm glad I hit that on accident. Okay, here we go. Uh, I guess I'm doing that quest or just heading in this direction until I find him. Oh, excuse me. The week after the 25th, uh, license for all Telltale's games expires, which means um, all their... They don't have the legal right to sell their games anymore, so they'll be pulled from the stores and unavailable for purchase forever. So what I did the other day was I went on Xbox Store. I should have done it on PlayStation Store, but I'm dumb, and I did it on the Xbox Store. Um, and I bought all four seasons of Telltale's Walking Dead, and I also bought the full first season of The Wolf Among Us. So I will be playing all of those on the channel eventually. I wouldn't expect them anytime soon. But uh, I wanted to own them before I would never have the chance to do so again. And we're going to play them at some point. So let me know if you would like me. Because I have the first episode of The Wolf Among Us on my channel from ages back when it first came out. Um, but I don't have any Telltale's Walking Dead. And so I thought you guys might want to see that. Because it's a very well-beloved series. So, yeah, let me know what you guys think about that, because I own all of them, and uh, whether or not you guys want to see a playthrough, I will be playing them. You're a fool, Melanipos. A fool! Melanipos. Did you lose your Pancration match? Worse. I lost my one true love. My Dracon has found someone else. I just That's know it. AstraZeneca symbol me. on your and chest And when we're there. together, he's always distracted. Hmm... Me. I'm not gonna give this guy false hope. Why would I do that? I admit, it doesn't sound good. Even you think I've been replaced. But I can't let him go. He's my golden demigod. Then you must have a plan. I'm going to make a potion. It's a recipe that guarantees eternal love. That seems morally That's an wrong. an honest way to save a relationship. Exactly. It's simple. I'll borrow his precious armor for a few days, coat the inside, and let the potion seep through his skin straight to his heart. I'm sure that's so not how that Rakon works. So, Rakon will be left without his armor. Are you worried he'll be vulnerable? Oh, he's the strongest, most chiseled man in Thebes. He'll be fine without it. Good to know. My problem is the last ingredient. I need to buy the rarest heaven Viotia from my herbalist. But she hasn't come to Thebes in a while. I guess I'm doing it. I can find her for you. Huh. I must believe in love after all. Thank you. Thank you. Do Where you will I find this herbalist? She lives on a farm love. west of the city, near the tomb of many kefs. Have I done that one yet? So Dracon is this guy's lover. And I'm gonna kill him. <laughs> Whoopsie. So they must be tied to quests I've already done. Sorry guys, I mean, I didn't know that. I was just doing random side quests uh, to level myself up off camera. I wasn't expecting the side quests to tie into the story at all. Rare herb, huh? Can I what is it? repurpose it? A herb for other hot things? enough to impassion him. Red hot to make his affections and his skin sizzle. That will be distracting. Okay. Tell me how you met. It's a tale for the edges. I moved to Thieves with dreams of becoming a great champion. I came Oops. to this gym and saw him. A mighty warrior with even a mightier smile. I wanted to learn from the best. But the only muscle he truly worked on was my heart. Oh, how cute. You guys see my pop socket for Detroit, by the way? Look how scratched up it is, like, already. It's only been a few months. So I'm thinking about making the exact same one, but reversing the colors. So, like, the background is white and the LED is blue, so the scratches will be less visible. I'm thinking about doing that. You're going to a lot of effort for Dragon. Is he working? He's ranting about he's completely living, random things. This session, I'm sorry. Heartless. You tell me. I've been so exhausted uh, this past week, ever since I got back from, from D.C. I've been, like, not doing anything these past weeks. Just like, ugh, like, I've been so tired. So now that I'm actually doing something and get to, like, talk to people, kind of, <laughs> I'm 
all over the place and just talking about random shit that don't even matter. If he's not here, where is he? Normally, we're both here night and day. The only time he leaves is to perform at the training ground. Oh, that, that's not a public venue. Okay. Yeah, assassinations in public venue have gone really well for me in the past. I'll go find that herb for you. <sighs> you helping Melanipos could help to weaken Drakon by removing his armor. I will go! I'll be back, Melanipos. <laughs> And I'm totally doing this with the purest of intentions. Solely for love. Now it's all for one and all for love. I like that song. <laughs> I grew up watching that movie. I watched that movie so much. And like, going back and thinking about it, I haven't watched it in ages. But I'm just like, wow, it was cheesy and not great. But I mean, Tim Curry's in it, so come on now. Uh, it's, it's a classic. Just kind of like uh, the, the Robin Hood movie, uh, Prince of Thieves with Kevin Costner. Pretty much the only reason I still watch that movie is Alan Rickman. Because he's the Sheriff of Nottingham, and oh my god. Like the place. He's amazing in that movie. Morgan yeah, Freeman's in it too, I like his character as well. But uh, yeah, we're not talking about that. Anymore. We're talking about Three Musketeers with, uh, um, is it, his name's Chris O'Donnell? Um... And Tim Curry, uh, Charlie Sheen is in it. Yeah, so... There's a lot of recognizable faces and, like, well-known names in, in the movie scene. Don't, uh... Don't. Oh, shit. Bandits! What a surprise! The fuck is wrong with you? And that dog is going crazy here. But yeah, like, the movie is... It doesn't age well, that's for sure, but I did like the song. Brian Adams, Rod Stewart, and Sting. Oh, that's not the dodge button. Okay. Come here, you. You see nothing! making completely random and not even relevant Detroit references, it's today. <laughs> Find and acquire herbs. I suppose I shouldn't burn these. If I want something from him, I probably shouldn't burn his supplies, They're gone. right? You can come out now. Thank you, Mr. Oh, if you hadn't intervened, we'd surely be dead. They must have really wanted something from you. The farm. farm. Yeah. It's one of the few untouched by the war. Herbs aren't free, you know. They'd have to root them and sell them. Speaking of herbs, that's why I'm here. I need to buy one for a man named Melanipos. Says he knows you. That troublemaker still wants to make the love potion. Well, he'll have it his way. I can sell you the herb he needs. Why would I... That is such a dick move. Like, <laughs> these people are running a business. I, whatever. Fine. Here. Here's the drachme. On second thought, you did save Epistanus and me. Thank you. I appreciate it. Hey, and I don't have to pay anyway! Cool. Thank you. I like you. Those banded corpses will make excellent fertilizer for my fields. Well, that's disturbing. Kind of taking back what I said. <laughs> I'm, re I'm rethinking <laughs> my, my previous thoughts. Okay. So I got it. Now I just have to go back to Melanipos. Oh, Melanipos! I have your herb thing. And I'm totally not having secondary plots in, in relation to what I just did. There. Your herb. It better be worth all the trouble. Oh, it is. Yes, yes. Dracon is mine. Till the end of time. Maybe I'll take him for a moonlit walk at the site of Iphigenia's sacrifice. The singing. He won't have to go far from his training site. Oh my god. I would break up with you two if you did that. <laughs> and his armor? 
It waits patiently for the potion in my house. Good. Be sure you take your time with it. For the potion to work best. Okay, so now he's without his armor. I shall go and murder him now. If I can find out where the hell he is. Okay, seriously, like, where is he? That's helpful. Located somewhere in Beatia? Would it have hurt to ask him where? Somewhere in Beatia. Oh. Over there. There he is. Oh. Okay. I was looking for the Agora, but uh, I guess he's over here. He's gonna notice this, I'm sure. Excuse me, my good man. Wow, you didn't give a whole lot of a shit, did you? Neither do I! Come at me, son! Oh shit. He mad. Oh shit, he mad. He just pulled a Barrett Dondarian! Ah! I'm on fire! Nope! Don't like it! Don't want it! Don't want any of it! Oh shit! Oh shit! He really likes that rage mode. Ow! God, even the shield bash just set me on fire? That seems a little unfair, just saying. Nope! Don't like that. Fuck your training post! Ah! The Lord of Light seems to be on your side. But you know who's on my side. The God of Death. And to the God of Death, you only say one thing. Not today. Oh shit. Ouch. Well, that was kind of cool. I will give you that. Woo! <laughs> Fuck you! Oh god, ow! Please heal yourself, thank you. I'm gonna wear him down just a little more and then finish him off with the execution. Thing. Ow! Fuck you! Oh, that's rage. Woohoo! Don't do it, do it, do it, do it, do it! Thank you! Ooh, ah. Mela, Mel, I already forget your name. Sorry. <laughs> this, this chapter of my life is gone. I don't need to remember the details anymore. Mela Nipos, I think. I don't fucking know. Okay, so I killed Dragon. I dracarist him into oblivion. And now I need to kill Aristaios. Island at the center of Lake Clopais, he's in the fort. Of course he is! Of course he is! Okay, so he's in there. Good thing I've already been here! I can fast travel right over there. I mean, I'm well aware. I'm on the island. You don't go anywhere, lipstick thing. He is! Holy is sh there? shit, he's right next to me. Found you. Okay. <laughs> I was expecting to have to go in the fort. Uh, looks like I missed a fight. Oh, what? What? Oh! <gasps> oh shit, it's you! Potter? Cassandra, what are you doing here? The same thing you're I doing, actually. He wouldn't have been a challenge for you. Ah, uh, stop it. But I'm glad our paths have crossed again. Dude, how would this be different if I killed him? What? Have you I been... never thought I'd see you again. What have you been doing? Does this mean Stentor will you like me better me now? In Megaris, but I lost my honor long ago. There is no way to go back and make it up to you. But I can fulfill my promise to Stentor now. Yay! So this is the point where we must be kind of like reaching the final stretch of the story. Final stretch. We still got a ways to go. But like, this has got to be it, right? Like, I let him live. And now I'm seeing 
how that affects the story, and I'm being rewarded for it. Or punished for it, like Corinthia. <laughs> this is the second time where I'm like, oh yeah, I did that. Okay. This is the last place I expected to find you. Right? I left Stentor with the greatest responsibility a man could carry. I couldn't leave him to face it alone. How thoughtful. Killing these champions will weaken the Athenian hold on the region and destroy the rebels' morale. I know. He sent me to do the same thing. I'm glad you're helping. You came all this way to help Stentor. Good. He needs it. It's about time I started protecting those I care about. You're right. You've changed so much. Well, this shucks. is who I've always been. You just weren't there to How see How about it. my real father? I will never be able to change that. Can you tell but me? I can do something now for someone who needs me. There are things Stentor must hear to succeed. Okay. Go. I wish you'd helped me back in Sparta. But Stentor does need help now. Even if he doesn't want to admit it. Stentor is as much your family as I am. You can still be there for him. I will. He may hate me, but I'm glad to have met him. In a way. <laughs> Goodbye. See the split Cassandra in my lip? Sparta. That, uh, <laughs> I think he did that. Bye-bye, Pater. That breastplate sucks. But, okay. Can I talk to you, daddy -o? No? Okay. So, he's gonna go help Stentor now. Maybe, okay, maybe he'll hate me less? I don't know. <laughs> I'm uncertain of exactly how that, that plays out in the story. Maybe if, maybe something's about to happen, and if the wolf Nikolaus wasn't there to, to help Stentor. Maybe Stentor would die or something. Wow, I honestly wasn't expecting to really see him again. Interesting. I didn't tell him anything! It's like, yeah, by the way, one of the kings of Sparta is a cultist. I found my mother, Marini, and she still hasn't told me shit about who my real father is, like you said she would. Like, it. What? <laughs> I didn't tell him anything. I'm just like, oh, hi, thanks. Go help your other child now. Bye! <laughs> Take him! Take him! Take him! <laughs> it's all Game of Thrones and Detroit references today. No, unlock. You're not killing any Spartans here today. Okay. Hello, Stentor! I am back. I have done You're as you back. asked. Yes, I am. The champions have been dealt with. You should be dead. You seem disappointed. The gods are punishing me. Didn't you want me to do it? Like... The gods are helping you. There's nothing godly about this. I have to speak to him in terms that he'll understand, right? So I gotta go the god route. They're not punishing you. They're helping you. Why do you think I'm here? The gods must hate me if our paths keep crossing. From what I've seen? You needed a divine intervention. Oh, shit. I don't have time for this. Sparta must take this region now, while we have the chance. Okay, then let's do it. I'm ready for war. Let's get this over with. I couldn't agree more. The sooner I'm rid of you, the better. Fuck you, dude. Really don't like you at all. <laughs> okay, hold on. Before we go to war... I gotta fix my lighting situation here, because it's getting later in the day, and as you can see, I'm a fucking ghost now. So pardon! Uh-oh. War Sparta! War Sparta! I haven't done one of these in a long time. I'm probably fucked. I'm Athenian, right? Okay. We need okay. to stick together. Oh shit, Al. Oh shit, that's the wrong button. There we go. No, stop it! Uh oh, rage mode incoming! Oh god. Took out a level 50 that fast? OMG. Okay. Rah! 
Yay! Beatia will now side with Sparta. Labdakos the Multiface was killed. 25 soldiers killed, 4 captains. Heck to the yeah! I will take it. I think that's the first time I've actually succeeded in one of those battle things. My first time. <laughs> Hi. Victory is ours! Do you like me now? I really don't feel like giving you the credit because you've been a complete dick to me ever since I got here. But I will be the better person. The victory is yours. You led us well today. My father taught me all I know about commanding an army. Too bad you took him from me. Or I might have learned more. Oh, fuck you, Stop. dude. Don't you dare tell me what to do. I am in command here. You needed my help. By the gods, how are you so arrogant? No wonder my father discarded you. Oh you my know god! About my family. I know he threw you off of a cliff and chose me instead. Oh, I oh wanna... now who's being arrogant? You were an afterthought. You were second place. We'll see about that. Oh my god, mean? why am I being nice to now you Now that we've driven the Athenians from the field, it's time I dealt with my true enemy. No! Stentor, Your you... job is done, mercenary. Now I will kill you for what you stole from me in Megaris. What could you possibly gain from killing me? Justice, vengeance, peace. One would be enough, but all three is better. You think vengeance will dull your pain? Trust me, it won't. Here's the thing. I don't trust you. What did I do? Like, I thought I did the right thing. Was I not? No. I would have taken him. I would have taken Nikolaus from him either way, whether he's dead or not. I feel like this is unavoidable. He hates my guts either way. Why are you doing this? Because. Because you marched into Megaris, ruined the fucking war, and murdered my father! Did I... I did what I had to. And so will I. But I didn't murder your father, he's still alive, dude. Also, didn't I do exactly what you told me to? How did I ruin the war? Oh my god, I... I hate this guy, but I don't want to kill him either. You don't have to do this, Stentor. Oh, but I do. There is nothing you can say to convince me otherwise. He's not this dead. This isn't what Nikolaus would have wanted. Oh, you fucking know. Traitor. Because I am not a traitor. I just talked to him like you two hours Sparta. ago. You betrayed your family. You killed my father and stole my chance at a normal life. You deserve nothing but the cold of my blade buried in your heart. Can I tell him he's not dead? Why would I not tell him he's not dead? Oh shit, dude. I'm not killing you. Please tell me that's an option. Oh, thank god. Oh, thank god. Okay. Killing each other will not heal the wounds of the past. Pater. Hello, Centaur. I could have just told him, but. Okay. I thought you were dead. So I would have had to kill him if he wasn't there. Oh, she God. should pay for what she's done. What did I do? I mean, I did nothing. <laughs> Especially now that he knows Nikolaus is still alive. I did nothing. How many times do I have to tell you? Stentor, she owes me nothing. I don't understand. You both have a greater role to play. Become the leader I trained you to be. Lead the armies of Sparta, and be victorious. How? You are an honorable man, a loyal son, and a great warrior. You will be a better commander than I ever was. You can do this. I will, father. I will make you proud. You already have. Are you gonna stop fucking hating me for no reason now? That could have ended badly. Uh -huh. <laughs> Cassandra, a shadow grows across Sparta. Be cautious when you return. I mean, I'm aware. Mother and I will deal with it. You found her? I did. Ruling Naxos. Sounds like her. <laughs> May the gods watch over you both. 
How about fuck that guy? Stentors, like seriously. Okay. But now... Oh, I don't like the sound of that. Talk to Marini in front of the throne room. I didn't find another clue as to who this guy is. Oh no, it's all the way down here. Damn, I still don't have that viewpoint. I should probably go do that. Oh my god, I hate myself. That's my nearest viewpoint. Oh god, okay, we're here. If I have to make a choice, it's gonna be Pausini S. Because that one letter is signed to me. Let me just... There's always review the evidence. There's no... There's no risk in me going over everything again. It's one of the kings, if not both. Where is he? There he is. Okay. <laughs> Who do you think you are? Who do you think you are? I'm just walking? Okay. Hello. Oh god. I'm really nervous. I'm I'm leaning towards Pausanias, to but I'm not sure who Are it is. Are you ready to take back our family's land? Of course. But my purpose here is to bring down the cultist king. You make your mother proud, Cassandra. Is this gonna be like Are a? Are you sure you have enough proof to accuse him? No. No. Ah. <laughs> uh. Is this gonna be another like Dione thing? Where they're twins that look alike, and you have to figure which one's Dione and which one's the High Priestess. Cause I almost fucked that one up. <laughs> I want to find that last clue. I have to be sure. I don't know. Maybe I should look some more. Accusing a king is not something you can take back. Make sure you're absolutely ready. Okay. Yes, ma'am. How do I find that last clue? It doesn't give me any hints as to where that last clue might be. 